hair. I told you, you look like a hobo. <laughs> Guys, I'm getting like postpartum baby hair so bad. Anyways, welcome to today's vlog. We are actually starting off this vlog at our second home. We haven't really talked much about this or even shown it because we haven't been able to come down here as much as we want to with everything going on. But quarantine in Utah is pretty much over. So we are down at our second home. If you guys haven't heard us talk about it, basically it's in Southern Utah where we moved from and we just wanted to have like a place to stay when we come down here with a baby and a puppy. There just was not room at Parker's parents' house. So we have this house now and it's actually been so nice to have just like our own place to stay Cole has her own room so we actually just put her down for a nap and we are finally going to do some stuff to this house we don't have like our new light hung up we don't have handles on the cabinets we have i'll show you guys our actually let's make our bed really quick guys a way to make your day so much better is to make your bed when my bed is not made I feel like my life is a mess. We're actually waiting on some furniture still. So right now our mattress is just on the ground. We are waiting on a few furniture pieces to get delivered. I don't know when that will be, but we have like a platform bed. We also have this, which I ordered forever ago. We've had this literally for so long, but we just like haven't put it together yet. I wanted to film it. So I got the cutest table from Target that I'm super excited to put together. Yeah, so let's make our bed really fast. All right, bed's made. Cove, every like Sunday morning, we usually turn on the SpongeBob for her. So we had that going, but I think we'll do this last. Yeah. We could put these blinds up. We just have, uh, we showed these to you guys before, but they're like the paper blackout blinds from Amazon. In our normal house, we got automated ones, which are actually so nice and so worth the money. So I'm kind of thinking I want to do it here just because it's such like a nice thing. Yeah, it is nice. But. Here's the but these are like 20 bucks, so. And in our place up there, we have a lot deeper window wells. Oh, so I didn't we, realize. So we couldn't do two different one, two different. Oh, we could do just blackout. These don't even feel like the same as we have at home. They're like way smaller, I just realized. Yeah, they might be smaller. Like these little things are way smaller. A smaller honeycomb or whatever. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, all right, let's head out here and get going on stuff. First thing we are starting with is hanging up this light. So this is what came in the house. We have this from Article. I think we showed you guys all this furniture already, but table and chairs are from Article. The lights from Article. All these cute prints are from Society6. I'm actually not sure what I even want to do. We want to like keep this house simple, but we definitely want it to still like feel homey. So I want to put something on this wall, but then we have this like giant blank wall over here that I don't really know. I was going to only put prints like up on this one, but I don't know. That wall feels just like kind of empty. I can't remember if I just showed these bar stools, but they're also from Article. So anyways, we're going to get this light hung up and... Do you know where the cabinet things are? Oh, right here. I ordered these on Amazon. So they're just gold little circles. So we kind of wanted to like swap this out for something gold just because you can find stuff on Amazon for such a good price. But I don't know, maybe we'll do that eventually. But anyways, I have a bunch of these. I ordered enough for all of the cabinets and all of the drawers. You know what I don't have? Is a stencil. Uh, do you have like a rule of measuring tape? I wonder if it maybe comes with one. I don't know. I might have a measuring tape. These aren't as hard as the other ones though, because right. they're just, just one, one hole. hole. Right. And Our other ones are like two, you know? Like right here, dead center. Yeah. Is that where they would go? Yeah. And where else would they go? Right here. Yeah, like centered across the whole thing, like yeah. centered this way and this way. Yeah. I'm so excited to get this light hung up. It's so cute. light is up and it looks so cute also fun fact if you guys didn't know when you build a house a lot of the time for some reason they put the dining light it's been like this in all three of the houses that we built it's never centered with like where the table would actually be it's really weird i know that you can like ask them to move it but yeah so the lights over here the table can't be like all the way over there or else it's in the way of like the walkway so it's a little bit off centered but that's just how it normally is that's how it is at our other house yeah the light's super cute That took Parker so long. <laughs> 
Yeah. I wasn't that mom. helpful. It's kind of like a one person it job. Is, like I can hand you stuff, but I don't know. But it looks super cute. This is from Target. I'll link it down below for you guys, but I love it. So we're gonna put it in our room. Coco also woke up from her nap. Good morning, girl. Good morning. Hi, baby. Okay, so we got the table in place. I love it, I think it's super cute. And then the bed that we got, like the actual thing the bed will sit on, I think it's like a pretty similar color to this. And then we're gonna mount the TV. We're trying to just keep it like super simple in here. I do think it would be fun to do like some vertical paneling on this wall, depending on how expensive it is and like how big of a project. We also are gonna swap out this light with one kind of similar to the kitchen, I think. We actually need to run to Target because we're out of wipes. We have like two more baby wipes. Ooh, what are you putting in your mouth? No. Nope. Don't put something in your mouth. I got this rug out. This is from Urban. So what we've had in here is this rug with this bedding, which this is also, actually this is all from Urban. This pillow is from Target, but we are gonna have a guest room for, <gasps> what are you eating? No, no, don't eat anything, please. We are gonna have a guest room so that if other families here, they can stay with us. We're getting another bed and then the same platform like bed stand thing that we're getting for this bed, we're gonna have over in the guest room. I was trying to decide if I should keep this bedding in here with this rug or if I should swap it with this one. It's kind of like, I don't have room to lay it out all the way, but I wanted to just show you guys what it looks like. I think it's super cute. So I have this rug and a different Coco, don't touch stuff. A different color of sheets that's over here. We also did get a washer and dryer. I didn't think we were gonna get one. I hadn't thought about like washing towels and stuff or even washing our sheets. I was just thinking we don't really need to wash like clothes when we're here. So at first we were like, oh, we're not really in a rush to get one, but we need to wash like our towels and sheets and all that stuff. Anyways, I got this color, which I think is so pretty. So this is from I Love Linen. I've had my eye on this forever. It's all wrinkly now, but I thought this would be super cute. There's a picture on Pinterest that has like this exact bedding, the vertical paneling on the wall. Yeah, I think it's super cute. So this will either be in here or the guest room or we can swap them or whatever. Yeah, super cute, but I love this table. I think it's so pretty and it was pretty inexpensive too. It's just from Target. So I'll link that for you guys. Okay, so fast forward a couple hours. We had some friends come over and visit us and we ate lunch and Cove went down for a nap and now she's already awake. Now it's time for the next little home upgrade that we're doing. I'm putting this thermostat, we got a Nest. The thermostat we have now isn't Wi-Fi or doesn't connect to your phone or anything, so we can't like control it from our other house and we can't control it, you know, remotely. This one you can. So we got this one. I'm gonna install it right now, get rid of the old one. First, it says that I need to take this one off and make sure that this one's even compatible. So I gotta take it off, make sure it works. And then if it works, hopefully it does, I'm gonna install it. Target run and Lauren is a Starbucks drinker. She asked if I wanted to try this new drink. I've been seeing what it all is over. It? It's passion like a something? passion fruit guava with coconut milk. Okay, we're gonna do a taste test. Oh, that's really good. Oh, that's really tasty. Wait, it's like so good. It's like really guava y. Mm -hmm. mm. I'm really passion fruity and it's so cute. It's like the cutest color I've ever seen. Cute summer drink. Mm -hmm. Two thumbs up. Very, very good. Okay, back from Target. I'll do a little mini haul. I was filming, so. Oh. So she just got back. She, we decided that I'm gonna put the thermostat on as soon as she gets back. Oh. Or I mean, as, not as soon as she gets back. We're gonna go for a little drive and I'm yeah. gonna put it on as soon as we get back. Yes. Got some cups. So, yeah. so cute. We don't have any cups here and we've been having to buy, I'm not having to buy, but we've been buying plastic water bottles. I don't like to buy plastic water bottles when we're at home because obviously we should be using something reusable like cups. So we finally got some, so I'm super excited. These were like 79 cents or something from Target. They had like a few different colors. Oh. You wanna see them? Those are cool, huh? Those are cups. Oh, I should've got like a baby size one for you. <gasps> you joined me. Anyways, I got six of those. I also got a can opener. This is something that we've needed like five times and we just haven't had it. I also got another spatula. We obviously use those a lot when we cook. And then I also got this little spoon for if we're making like soup or something. And then somehow these ended up in my basket. Oh, nice. 
I also have seen a lot of people using this on TikTok and I've used it before but not for like a long time. But anyways, I got this mascara and we also got some baby wipes which is the main reason that I needed to go to Target because we're out, we have like two left. You didn't get to go to Target with mom, huh? You're sleeping. Yeah, you're doing so good though for daddy. Oh yeah, she is. Were you taking a nap? Do you have soup in your nose? Did you get it out? Oh, I think so. Oh, <laughs> you sneezed on my face. Can I have a kiss? Mm. She's mm. been getting a lot of kisses today and yesterday. Let's see, can mommy have a kiss? Mm. Thank you so much, that's so nice. Can I have another kiss? Mm. Thank you, that's so, so sweet. Thank you so much. So you filmed this? I filmed, yeah, like about to change it and then you pulled in the driveway and then said, let's go on a drive. So I stopped. Now I'm gonna eat one of these. Okay, so fast forward a few days, we are back home. That was all the footage that we got for that vlog. I wanted to give you guys a little update on how the thermostat install went. I did have some issues with that. So basically we went on our drive and then came back and it was later in the evening and I decided to change out the thermostat and I started changing it out and I was removing the old one. And when I was removing it, one of the cords that I pulled out kind of like sparked a little bit and I was kind of thinking it might've did something wrong, but I just kind of brushed it off and continued. And I got it off and then I got the new one on and all of it installed and I put it on and it popped up with a little error screen saying that the red cord, which is the one that sparked, was not getting power to it. I walked around the house, I flipped all the breakers, thought it might have done that. I walked through the house and clicked on and off all the GFI or I think that's what it's called, but they're like the little buttons, you know, like in your bathroom. Those things will sometimes flip and it wasn't any of those. So luckily that was our last night there. The AC was off through the night the, it was cool enough that we were fine. Woke up, left the next day, and then I called an electrician and had them, them come out and look at it. And it was just a fuse that uh, burst or something, I don't know, up in the attic. So he got up and switched that out got it all fixed and now everything's working. So it started out as a little bit of a pain, but now everything is working great and our AC is going and it's all fixed. So that's the end of that story. Now that it is the end of the vlog, I am going to do a hashtag Parker super secret show. Today's question is from Abigail. Will you guys ever come out with merch? I know you guys have your clothing line, but will there ever be any merch more personalized towards you, both Coco and Luma? I'm not gonna say exactly, but I am gonna say a little bit. I think, yes, there will be some merch coming in the future. I'm not gonna say exactly or any details, but I will tell you there is gonna be merch, I think. So be looking forward to that. Be following in all of our videos and we will make an announcement when that does happen, if it does. That's gonna be all for today's video. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys subscribe and hit the thumbs up button and we will see you in our next vlog. Bye guys. Bye.